computers I'm setting up um, for a friend, and it's got the it's the older older style. It's got this kind of setup here where uh, you can plug an old QX into. And so I've got a bunch of these old computers I'm building specifically for the old QX system. This particular one I've got the old control delete option on it. So you need to press alt control and delete uh, to get in. And let's see, delete is, where is delete on this one? Delete is right here. So alt control delete. Alt, Control, Delete, and it also gives you this this uh, uh, dialog box to verify that you're the authorized uh, person, and then you got to click OK. And here I've got a another password in here, and so this particular password is going to be uh, let's see, it's going to be uh, R R E S add min and then <clears throat> I put a password in this is going to be class 32 and then we press ok and we should be good this this is like the bare kind of minimum computer uh, for the system I've also got okay so I haven't got the driver set up for the box itself at this point so uh, it's gonna try and install it see what happens it's not gonna find it it's a USB serial controller which I'll probably have to add later um, and so USB serial controller driver um, and so This has also got the Nano Voice. Nano Voice is the Sherry Edwards uh, voice analysis program. Uh, Sherry Edwards was the lady who could hear frequencies that no other people could normally hear. And then she was actually a able to tone a or hum a a counteracting frequency to certain stress frequencies that she found in her son. Okay, so her son broke his arm. He was bleeding profusely. She toned or hummed a uh, frequency to counteract the bleeding. So uh, that's her voice analysis program. It's called the Nano Voice. And so basically, it does voice analysis. She has a whole... Uh, a whole program that uh, of course you want to plug your microphone in and say de, do, ra, mi, do re mi fa so la ti do and it will give you the different frequencies of your voice and give you a little bit of options on how to analyze it and uh, sound health okay so I'm not sure if that website's still up but basically that's the nano voice also have the <clears throat> multi oscillator multi frequency oscillator generator audio generator on here you can put you can put right frequencies and you can fit, change all these frequencies and you could put uh you know 528 or whatever and uh you get all these different frequencies you can put in here 10 at the same time and uh And then you can just put your headphones on or whatever. You can put it in an amplified system and then play all the play all these frequencies. And so it actually has a separate frequency generator program, a separate frequency uh, therapy program inside of it. And so they sell the. Uh, there's a European organization that does sell the old QX software. Uh, basically, it's kind of an as-is setup they sell, and uh, they charge, uh, well, currently they're charging about 60 euros for the software, and uh, I don't know the exact details, but basically, 
you can put we can put the software on an older computer it has to be an older computer with the uh, you know the older style printer port and uh, the 32-bit system because uh, the old QX will not work on a 64-bit system it's got to be a 32-bit system like this older Dell um, so and so yeah so that's that's basically what I've been doing lately and uh, the, uh, I'm not sure the details about the European QX software, but uh, I will be finding out very soon, and uh, I'm uh, going to be getting the old QX software uh, so that you don't have to throw your old box away, and if you can't afford the new stuff, you just want to uh, do this as a hobby, that's fine. It's, it's not really uh, recommended for com commercial use, and as a matter of fact, um, you consult a professional on the matter. But thanks for watching and have a great evening or day or morning. Adios amigos.